Hello friends, welcome to Upsheet. In this video, we are going to learn about how to create employee attendance in Google Sheet with the help of Upsheet app. Using Upsheet app, you can create and update completely formatted attendance sheet directly from the app. That too within a minute. So let me just take you to the action. As you can see on your screen, on right side there is uh, Upsheet app and on left side I have logged into the Google Drive of Upsheet email. So on the app you can see there is uh, information in the slider. This is the first ever mobile app to create Google Sheet directly from app. Easy and fast, verified and trusted. Upsheet is verified by Google and trusted by 50,000 plus Google Sheet users. To use Upsheet, we need to log in using Google account. So I will just log in with Upsheet Google account that we see on the right website. As you can see, I have already created some sheets uh, in Upsheet application. There are multiple templates here. But for today's video, we will be using attendance plus template to create employee attendance sheet. So let's get started. Here we will need to enter the sheet name. I will just enter employee attendance and the name of the attendees it can be students, candidates, here we have employees or staff you can use. I will keep the duration as it is. You can change it to any month, any week. And these are the attendance status. Present, absent. So we will just remove them and add new status. Come with full name so that uh, you can easily understand this is present absent you can change the color of the status as well then we have half day we have sick day Then paid leave. And unpaid leave. You can change the colors. So all the status we have added, different status. So that's it. Now we'll just click on create spreadsheet and a Google Sheet will be created that to a formatted Google Sheet so let's refresh on the left side you can see employee attendance we we'll just open it yes so this is completely formatted this is employees that we have named here the tab name Till the end, end of the June, start to end of the June. So, employees tab here, this is attendance tab. So, we need to add the attendees here. So, we'll add three, four attendees or employees, we can say. Just can just rename it. 
I spelled it correctly. Okay. We have one more. So it will be uh, easier to check everything with multiple attendees. You can see on the left side we have all the attendees listed in the Google Sheet and that's how it looks in the app. So when you go to the attendance tab, you see all the attendees or employees listed here. You can just update attendance commonly for all as well using present, absent, update like that. So for first June, let's, let's just update the attendance to present for all. Yes, as you can, on left side you can see the attendance is updated and uh, on here it, it's asking us to go to the report. You can go to the report by clicking on the attendee name. So we'll update few more dates and then we'll go to reports. On second, let's change status of one of the employee to absent and let's change it to a sick day, a paid leave. So we, that's how it looks. You can use uh, short forms as well, like P A U L P L. Now we can go to reports from anywhere, from this tab or from this tab as well. So we'll check the report of Sonia. That's how it looks, Sonia attendance report. Two days she was present and one day on second she was absent. So that's how it looks. Mark days. And you can share this attendance in a PDF format. You can just generate a PDF attendance report directly from the app. out you can see the employee attendance sheet so that's how easy it is to create an attendance sheet using upsheet app hope you found this video useful and it will hope it will help you in your business so thank you for watching this video see you in the next